Hey guys, so we're quite in a different setup than usual. I apologize for this, but I'm back home in my parents' house. Um, so for today, I have uh, my sister actually bought a coffee grinder and I forbid her to open it before I actually unbox it because I really um, want to unbox and present as many things as possible because why not? It's fun and it's interesting. So for today we have a Sencor. It's an electric burr grinder and she wants to use it for her uh, filter coffee making and also for some Turkish. I'm not quite sure this is going to be good enough for, for Turkish coffee, but I believe for filter coffee is going to be more than enough. So let's quickly see what's inside the box and the looks of this uh, little thingy. On the side note, I apologize for my voice because I'm a little bit under the weather. Okay, so this seems to be the uh, the device. It looks quite interesting. Uh, it has the metal built with plastic. The plastic parts do look a little bit cheap, I do have to say. Um, this is the coffee grinding part that you just put under there. It doesn't even fit that easily as I presumed it would. Okay, it's in there. Um, the top here has a little rubbery uh, part that allows this to seal the connection so there's no like coffee uh, flying around on the upper part you can choose how many cups you're you're uh, grinding so it goes all the way from two to ten cups this is a clicky sound here so this probably is the activator um, on the side here you can see actually the dozing so it says you have from plunger to espresso, so drip. And what is this here? Oh, percolator and then espresso. It's quite clicky, but it's, it really does not feel that uh, high quality. So I'm not sure about that. Need to check that more. Um, <clears throat> the upper storage tank. For coffee, here you can, there's a lock unlock button so you can unlock it and release it. So it has a shutter that obviously closes automatically as soon as you do the rotation. So there's nothing dripping out when you pull it off. And as you can see here, this is the feeder for the, for the burr grinder and it's all metal. Uh, it looks quite sharp but also doesn't look the highest level of quality. But I guess that's fine. We need to check it out, see how it works um, and see uh, what kind of bean grinding capabilities it has and if the quality is any good. So let's just put this back together. Um, doo -doo -doo. Okay, so I guess oh, this is the open position. Okay, and this is then in. So that's the grinder. Uh, you get some instruction manuals, the cleaning brush, and the collecting, uh, collecting uh, container for the coffee. All in all, uh, so metal combined with some cheaper plastics. Uh, the quality is not as good as I expected. So back home, I have a, gra uh, a graph or graph, or how do you say it, a grinder, which is a similar price tag, but I think it has a better quality build. I need to compare the grind size and the output, but I'm gonna do that later. So I'm gonna probably shoot some 
tiny little videos of the grinding action and grinding action and get the, the the sound of the machine and stuff uh recorded so that's it for me today uh it was a quick unbox um thanks a lot for watching if it was interesting for you you know what to do if it was not well then i bid you farewell <laughs> um yeah I'm off to make some morning coffee because I still didn't have mine, so I need to wake up. Cheers, guys.